Hello everyone, welcome to Bluebird Healing Channel. Um, today's reading is also a general timeless reading. Um, I'm going to pull out oracle cards, um, only oracle cards, because I really want to find out the messages uh, from the universe and your um, guides and angels, uh, especially at this time. So this is the general reading, not specific to any sign. So it may or may not resonate with you. So take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Um, I also wanted to make an announcement. I will to um, what is it that you need to release with you tomorrow for all signs because um, a new moon because of the new moon, which is on 8th um, uh, August. And it's also um, Lion's Gate portal is opening, Lion's Gate, we're moving through that. So I'm going to do that reading and new moons are very good to set new intention, but for that we actually need to release something um, in order to step into the new. So I'm going to ask uh, in, tomorrow's reading what is it that we need to release so yeah let's get right into your reading uh, okay messages <laughs> this came into the previous reading too that i did a general message okay one more card i'm going to pull up I hope you can see the cards. Um, watching clouds. Uh, this message is uh, coming out in almost all the readings in one way or the other, not the same card, but the same message. Uh, lie back, rest and relax. At this time, all we can do is rest, relax, and pass through this, this really, you know, um, high vibrational also very um, difficult in a way because there's a lot of push and pull of the energies happening right now and so all you can do at this time is to all uh, you know uh, is um, what is asked of us is to lie back rest and relax and that's it beautiful message great adventures take a risk venture forward some, some of you are probably asked to, have, you've been planning to go somewhere, move. Um, this could be physical travel, actually movement forward, or this could actually be moving away from something that you've always known and you're being asked to step into something new because there's, there's a great adventure that is waiting for you. And yes, you, you've, you're asked to take a risk at this time and it's going to be amazing if you do that. And distant thunder, clear the air. So perhaps there's a, you're, you're being affected by perhaps the other people's drama, or it could be perhaps a previous conflict. You're energetically uh, still attached to someone um, uh, that you're in separation with, or perhaps you're being affected by other people's problems or drama that are at a distance from you. So you, you, you're asked to clean up your energy, your space, and also perhaps um, if there's a fallout with someone, um, a friend, a relative, um, a, 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 you know, a past lover or a, a, a partner, it, you need to clear the air because see you can't move forward with with this conflicting energy and this this sort of you know regret or any kind of drama of that sort in your life so i think you you're asked to clear the air you don't really have to necessarily contact that person you can just 
uh, forgive and forget <laughs> and move on from that perhaps you know if it's just I'm not at telling you to contact anyone or you know things like that but it's totally up to you this is what I feel uh, from this card right now I don't know why hmm. um, and we have embracing enthusiasm shout to the heavens with happiness um, some of us are I, I, I don't know if you felt that I certainly have there's a lot of uh, newfound energy in in our tanks and, and a new uh, found passion for uh, you know taking action towards our you know um, the towards the things that we always wanted to do because you see moon is in uh, the sun is in Leo uh, at this time and Leo is the energy of you know enthusiasm life you know it's ruled by the sun and we all know what it means you know so um, it, it, we you will probably you must have felt this energy of you know uh, this newfound enthusiasm for life and for 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 creative projects especially so uh, you're being asked to embrace this enthusiasm focus on that more and shout to the heavens with happiness such a beautiful energy such a beautiful card and of course what you focus on in your life if it's little newfound enthusiasm and little things that make you happy or bring joy to you that thing becomes bigger that's what I believe. That's what Law of Attraction believes too. Um, I am going to pull out three article cards. Don't let pride get in your way. I think you're being called to see if there's something that you are um, not, you're holding back from, or if there's something that you're holding on to too tight ask yourself again if this is out of love or if this is out of pride and ego if it, if the impulse is to um, be prideful or stick and stick to your old paradigms or if do you really believe in in those ideas and things so we are being asked to not let pride get in our ways because if we do that and not change with with the change that is happening for us or the chance that is given for uh, to us to change um, then you know you, you you will stay stuck there full moon in Leo and so you will just be stuck there um, yeah Emotions are running high, super moon. Yes, emotions are running high because there's, uh, like I said, a lot of push and pull and um, we're moving through the, the portal, Lions Gate. And uh, also there's a new moon uh, in Leo and then full moon in Aquarius, the second full moon, which is rare in Aquarius on 23rd, I think. Yeah. So emotions are running high which is why lie back rest and relax look at the bigger picture you will probably find that in your interactions um, old patterns um, and old triggers will be brought to you uh, because because of the emotions you know at this time emotions are running high you need to center your energy 
um, do some meditation, um, focus more on within rather than the um, outside, um, you know, um, yeah. So just center your energy, otherwise there will be a lot of uh, triggers or something. This is what I feel from this card. Uh, look at the bigger picture. Um, this is interesting, but I don't know why I feel that some of some of you have probably um, did not want to move, but the circumstances or the things that happened. A lot of people have lost many things that they were attached to. Many relationships have been, you know. Um, uh, Ah, just difficult circumstances and everything but you need to look at the bigger picture at this time the changes for your good um, the you know the uh, all you need to understand is that the rejection is the God's protection so perhaps you're being protected you need to see that the things are happening at for the right reasons in, in your life at this time. So don't um, hold on too tight to um, what you, or, or do not focus on one circumstance as, you know, an independent um, thing, but look at the bigger picture as to why it, it happened to you, why it just played out in a certain way and how it impacted the overall, um, life, uh, your life and um, the life of people around you or, or th also think about the circumstances that are happening globally, collective, on the, on the collective, um, uh, you know, on the basis of the collective. Um, so look at, look at all of that. Also understand, I think you're also being asked to understand all the shifts that are happening right now. And that's what is also going to give you this perspective of of why certain things happen to you and in your life or why are you going through some something that you perhaps don't understand so perhaps you're not alone and there's you know some yeah bigger picture perhaps a divine plan you know who knows <laughs> so you and your loved ones are safe. Such a beautiful card. You're told that, yeah, you and your loved ones are safe. You're being protected by the guides, by the angels. Some of you perhaps are on your spiritual path or journey and you're being protected at this time. Um, I'm going to take some cards from the Archangel Oracle deck. I'm going to pull out the cards. Okay, no. <laughs> I'm going to fall, not pull out. Okay. And oh, this came earlier too. Prosperity. I hope you can see the card. Beautiful. Archangel Ariel. Your material needs are provided as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. So do not worry. <laughs> Angels are um, and universe is providing for your material needs. All you have to do is just follow your intuition and manifest your dreams, whatever dreams that you have. This is the lucky time. This is the lucky time. So um, focus on what is it that you want to manifest? What kind of reality do you want for yourself? And do not worry because universe is with you and it's providing for your material needs. Just follow your dreams, go after whatever you want to go after. You know, um, if you want to learn something new, if you want to travel, you know, anything, just do, do that. Change your career, perhaps. Creative writing, Archangel Gabriel, this, this seems like a very specific message for someone. <laughs> you can see this. And uh, you will know when you see this that it's for you. Archangel Gabriel, 
Make time to write down your thoughts in a journal or pen, an article or book. So yes, write what you know, write your truth. Some of you per perhaps are very good writers and you have this skill that you have never really um, explored or um, really uh, brought um, to the world. So you're, you're now being asked to follow uh, this passion or this talent that you have um, share it with the world beloved one beloved one um, Archangel Shamuel I am helping you with your spiritual soulmate relationship beautiful some of you perhaps have been trying to manifest love into your life your true soulmate love this could al also be friendship this soulmate can be anyone um, you know someone that you feel connected to um, and perhaps it's a it's a it's a relationship romantic relationship some of you are probably looking for a perfect partner love and don't if you're trying to manifest that do not worry um, uh, uh, archangels are helping you with your spiritual soulmate relationship Patience, this card came out in my earlier reading also today. Yes, we have to be patient. I know, I know. Because, you know, Leo is also an energy where, you know, being patient seems very, very difficult. But that's the only thing that you can do right now. Just have patience and trust. So, Archangel Jophiel, your dreams are blooming more rapidly than you realize. Still, they need nurturing and patience beautiful card and i'm going to take three cards from the fairies oracle of the fairies let's just see what comes out beautiful reading amazing cards advice and messages what do people need to hear today let's say messages okay Okay, um, friendship. Fairies and humans alike need friends. Now is the time to seek out those who will support and encourage you on your journey to fulfill your dreams. You're being asked to actually go out, connect with people and find your soul tribe people who will support you in your dreams, like-minded people. Uh, hidden depths, and also because you're not alone, you don't have to be alone. Just go out and you know find people that resonate with your energy or match your energy. Mm -hmm. Hidden depths, something hidden is about to come to light. Perhaps the secret or memory at the back of your mind, when we expose what's hidden, we can become free. I feel that it's like um, uh, a repressed memory of some kind of trauma. I don't know why I feel that right now, but I, 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 that's what I intuitively, intuitively feel, feel like saying uh, this message, that I think it's a repressed memory of the past trauma that will free you from your old patterns and help you heal and your us this is just going to come to you and you're not asked to focus on that but it's just going to come to you life energy the happy fairy of sunshine brings lots of life giving energy she reminds you to shine your light and to reveal anything in the shadows that needs to be healed this card looks very simil similar to this this is sort of an ep epiphany you know a realization seems like that but this seems like um yeah life energy giving energy so we are uh, we are called to shed light on on our shadows 
and the patterns that we have been repeating and to heal from that you can't really run away like i say you can't really run away from your shadow and your uh, demons and the things that are hidden and we have just shut them somewhere within it's it's you you can't get rid of we can't just you know leave them behind we have to work through them confront them and then heal those things i know it's a very difficult uh process but trust me that's the only thing uh, or, or, or the only way of, for to move forward healed and uh, really uh, empowered so ask for help angels are celestial beings who protect everyone and the fairies say now is the time for you to ask for angelic assistance such a beautiful card you're being asked to pray pray to whatever you believe in any form of divine a higher power um, whatever higher power you believe in just ask for help from them ask your angels to help you with whatever situation that you're going through just pray leave your worries to the universe such beautiful energies such a beautiful lovely reading i hope it resonates <laughs> and some of the messages help you uh, move forward um, yeah, thank you for your time uh, and uh, if you um, if this reading resonates and you like the content that I post please like and share the video so the messages can you know they they go to more people and people other people can see them the messages and also subscribe to my channel uh, thank you so much for your time. Love and light. Take care. Bye.